So this is how William Herschel discovered infrared. We all knew that visible light existed um, because we can see it. So he shone visible light at a prism and the prism split up the visible light into the colours of the rainbow. And then Herschel got some thermometers and he positioned them around the light coming out as it was split up. And he noticed actually that thermometer A's temperature went up the most, even though it wasn't actually in the path of any of the light coming out of the prism. From that, Herschel deduced that there must be some invisible radiation which he couldn't see, which was causing the temperature of thermometer A to go up. And that invisible radiation was infrared. A scientist called Johann Ritter discovered ultraviolet in a similar manner. He used something called silver chloride to find out that UV existed. Silver chloride, uh, when red line was shone on it, turned black, but quite slowly. When Ritter shone violet light on silver chloride, it turned black faster. But when, using a prism, he shone some light which could not be seen, which was near the violet end of the spectrum, silver chloride turned black the fastest. So this invisible radiation which turned silver chloride black the fastest was called ultraviolet.